Hello, everyone, and welcome to the all the Z fans joining us live from the U.S., Japan, and around the world. And what we we took inspiration from the special version that came out a couple of years later, where they they put a clear lens on the 240. And that actually, in the sunlight, the reflections in that around the, the car broke the pure circle of the headlamp into two. And we thought, this is it. This is how we're going to do it. So we did ultra-modern technology, but at the same time, feeling like the 240. And to be inspired by the, the memories, the parting line, the hood, the cheekbones, all must create the grill. The grill is not an artificial element. It's the result of things that uh, around it. So that's the front. Let's, let's take a, a walk around to the back. So as I mentioned, the roof line tapering back and this cut off rear end, which is very 240. But about 31 years ago, my first trip to Japan, uh, I opened the studio door. I just joined Nissan and 300Z was a clay model in the studio. And actually, I wanted to go home and restart my life because that was so modern, I, I couldn't believe it. So naturally, some of these sensual, simple elements and this sense of high tech is very much three, 300. But in the, the Proto, we use the, the capsule element from 300. But of course, it's an edge lit LED to give you this again, this sense of tomorrow. And why don't we step inside? Because here is also an interesting twist. These have been about performance. Yes, they're beautiful, but they're wonderful things to drive. So um, what we did here is that we took the purposefulness of the 240 and wrapped it around the body. So when you get into the, the Proto, you will feel the car is, is part of you. All the elements are right at your eye level. So as you're driving, you can keep your eyes on the road. And we've introduced modern era things. We have a full digital meter. And of course, we have our information uh, in the center. But everything is organized horizontally and has a purposeful beauty to it. So these are some of the things that we'll have much more time to talk about a little later. But uh, I cannot stop. Uh, this kind of brief introduction without talking about the meaning of the color. Because 240 had a yellow, my one, wonderful 300 had a yellow. Um, but at, the, at the 30 years ago, the technologies with the paint uh, really created a situation where the designers had to desaturate the yellow for the 300Z. Using modern technologies, we were able to add pearl and add these technologies of modern day and keep the yellow. So when you see this car go outside, this color comes to life in an amazing manner. So um, really happy to walk around this with you today. And um, I know we'll have some, some more time to talk in detail, but uh, I really want to thank you for, for being lovers of Z and supporting us all the time. So thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you.